A new biomedical sciences program is up and running at Coon Rapids High School this year. It's been a long time coming, but there is definitely excitement in the air because of what the curriculum means for the school and the students in District 11. CTN's Jamie Karat reports. The phone is off the hook. A syringe is nearby. There's vomit, blood, and a powder substance near Anna Garcia. The scene is set for these Coon Rapids students to essentially become crime scene investigators for the next 22 days. We have a number of different powders that are going to react differently to some indicators. This hands-on lab is part of a new biomedical sciences program offered at Coon Rapids High School, and it is the only one of its kind in the North Metro. And do not let the tip of the bottle touch the substance. A lot of these kids are looking for careers of some time in medical, and we want to give them the tools. 160 students signed up to be the first to embark on what the school hopes to be a long and successful journey through the program. Oh yeah, it's dissolving. Yeah, it's dissolving. The goal is for students to start as freshmen and finish as seniors, something Madeline Getchell says she plans to do. I thought it'd be good to like get into colleges and stuff and maybe make me more certain on what I want to do when I'm older. Program coordinator Leah Sam says giving students the ability to earn college credits while streamlining what they want to study in university is both a money saver and a boost for the medical world. The program is also going to teach students valuable life lessons. This challenges them. It gets them out of the box and it gets them ready for real life. One thing you never do when you're testing for substances, you never taste them. For now, though, these crime scene investigators have a job to do, and that is to determine what the white powder was next to Anna Garcia and how she died. It, we determined it was aspirin, so we could lead, we were thinking heart attack, she was taking a low dose of aspirin for it or, or something like that. The biomed program at Coon Rapids High is part of Project Lead the Way, which is a national nonprofit organization that provides STEM education curriculum for schools across the country. Karen, Steve? Wow, uh, school is no longer boring these days, it looks no, like. No, not at all. <laughs> all right. Thanks, it's like Jamie. Fun.